everyone. Today I'm going to be walking you through your auditioning day number two assignment. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to share my screen with you like I always do so that you can follow along with what I'm doing. Um, this week is we're getting to know our monologues and um, getting ready to oops, getting ready to prepare for auditioning. We're working on TEKS uh, 1E and 1F. 1E is applying your knowledge of theater vocabulary and terminology. So this is talking about things like slate, monologues, um, and all the vocabulary terms with associated with auditioning. Um, and then TEK 1F, explore and evaluate the structure and the form of dramatic literature. Your dramatic literature being your monologue that you're auditioning with. You're gonna start out by answering your top three questions, our email address, theater class period, which should be second period or sixth period. Your last name, comma, your first name. Um, we will watch a little bit. You will watch a little bit of this video if you have not already. You wanna focus on the part of um, where it talks about prepping for your audition. Um, so we did, it's about, Let's see. Yeah. It starts at about three minutes where she's talking about like where you should rehearse, um, how you should rehearse. And so that's kind of the section that we're watching. Um, and that will go up to about six minutes. So from minute three to minute six, that's what you're going to be looking at today. Um, once you watch that part of the video, you can continue on. Today you're going to continue working on the monologue part of your audition. And so um, we have our requirements here that we went over yesterday. One more time. This is just reminding you what our end goal is. Our end goal is to have a completed monologue performance that's 30 seconds to a minute long. That includes a slate or introduction. Um, and then also, of course, a memorized, well-rehearsed, practiced monologue. And so our questions that we have here <clears throat> excuse me, are really just a check-in. Um, have you found a monologue yet? Yes, or are you still looking? We have our link to the monologue so that you can open it up and access your monologue. And we have our reminders of things to look for. So today, as you are looking for your monologue, you're answering these questions. So this is once you have a monologue that you have found and you've chosen to do. Um, you are going to answer these questions. I'm gonna fix that one. I know it doesn't look good right now. It doesn't have any options, but it will. Um, you will tell me who your monologue is directed at. You will tell me a brief summary of what your monologue is about. And then you'll tell me what type of monologue is it, what type of monologue it is. Is it a comedy or a tragedy or does it have a little bit of both? And last but not least, you're going to tell me the age of your character. So these questions are all asking you about the specific things that you should be looking for when you're choosing your monologue. And so you're just giving me your responses there. The last thing you're going to do today is you're going to start working on memorization. If you have already chosen your monologue, now is the point where you need to start memorizing it. You must have it memorized for this recording. I don't want to see people reading on the screen or holding the paper in front of them or a Chromebook in front of them because you don't know it. So um, on this page, on this little slide here, I have some different ideas of things you can do to memorize. Um, you're going to choose one of them. You'll select your choice here of what you're going to do. And then you will start working on it. For a lot of these, you will need a separate sheet of paper. Um, so go ahead and grab that at home. Um, and if you're here face to face with me, I can help you out with that. And so you're going to choose one, just one of the strategies to start working on your memorization. And then your last thing you're gonna do today is you're gonna give me your status. Um, where are you at in your monologue search? Did you find one? Do you need me to pick one for you? Because we don't have a lot of time to waste, guys. We need to kind of really get working on these monologues so that we can audition and start on the show. So um, once you tell me what your status is and click submit, and you've completed your memorization strategy, you're done for today. And so, 
If you have any questions about auditioning, about your monologue, about anything really, remember you can always reach out to me on Google Classroom comments, um, email, uh, Remind101, Instagram, TikTok, um, or any of our other ways that you can communicate with me. Also, come into our live sessions. I miss y'all. I miss seeing you guys. So um, remember, I'm always here. I'm always here to help, and I can't wait to see um, what work you're starting to do on your monologue. All right, um, that's it for today. Remember, today is a good day. You are in control of you, and every day is a great day to do your best. See y'all later. Bye.